All right, thanks, Cass. We're live at 11 with this view over Florida A&M University. Thousands of people coming to Tallahassee this weekend for FAMU's homecoming. Millions of dollars being put into the Tallahassee economy. Now at 11, ABC 27's Micah Cho adds up how much money is coming into the city and how it's helping local businesses. We're able to have a chance to speak to uh, just different people from around the country. Whether you're a FAMU graduate from Washington, D.C. I'm going to several homecomings. FAMU is the best. Or Wayne County Commissioner Alicia Bell from Detroit. FAMU has a history of having wonderful homecoming celebrations, having so many wonderful students that are here and who are coming back. 17,000 out-of-county visitors come into Tallahassee every year during FAMU's football season, a majority of those coming for homecoming. We were able to uh, build revenue for our, our businesses as far as being able to build capital for other ventures that we may be trying to go into. Jerry Battles of Right on Q Barbecue was one of the hundreds of businesses outside of Bragg Memorial Stadium Friday afternoon. The money he'll make this weekend will be able to put him over the hump to afford a food truck and later a brick and mortar restaurant. It definitely does help build your brand. The Capital City Chamber of Commerce estimates around $7 million is being put into Tallahassee's economy every year due to FAMU football. This year, that money means a lot after the pandemic canceled the celebration in 2020. Now that money is going into hotels, restaurants, and shops around the capital city. In Tallahassee, Micah Cho for ABC 27.